in this video i will discuss about the brushless dc motor i control the bldc motor with remote control sometime you face problem motor is not running smoothly and sometime it is running smooth but with big sound and sometime it is running smooth but when you stop it sudden stop and it make a jerk how to solve this problem hey in this video i will show you how to solve this problem bldc motor converts electrical energy into rotational motion brushless dc motor has a permanent magnet inside the stator has a coil arrangement but just know when i run the motor you see and listen the one motor is running smoothly and other motor is running with the big sound so i will show you how to solve this problem before that we need to know how this motor works why we use the shift dc motor because it is having low maintenance and high efficiency bldc motor requires a complex controller to convert dc power three phase voltage by applying the dc power to coils the coil energized and become a electromagnetic the operation of a bld is based on the simple force interaction between a permanent magnet and the electromagnet by passing a dc current through the coil windings we generate an electromagnet with these poles the poles then interact with the poles of the permanent magnet and make the rotor spin rotor and stator are attracted to each other as the rotor nears coil a coil b is energized after every half turn of the rotor to keep the rotor spinning when the rotor near the coil b coil c is energized in this video you can see one motor is running smoothly but other motor is get stuck are running with heavy sound so what i will do i will change the sensor cables with each other so then the motor will run smoothly correct position of the rotor and switching of the polarity of the current in the coil winding this switching of phase is called commutation coil a then b then c energize this process repeated the rotor continues to rotate in bldc motor permanent magnet become a rotor and coil winding become a stator sensor is giving the information of the rotor when one coil is energized pull the rotor the second coil behind this also energized which push the rotor the bldc motors are designed with multiple pole pairs one pole pair two pole pair and four pole pair is depend on the how many coils are designed the combined effect produce more torque and more power output from the motor the combined force also makes sure that a bldc has a constant torque nature bldc have a trapezoidal shape and are commonly controlled by trapezoidal control trapezoidal is six step commutation is a commonly used in high speed application or where higher starting torque is required rotor position is determined by three hall effect sensor by changing the sensor twice with each other you can get rid of this problem this normally happen when you repair and you forget the cables or cables are not properly coded here i am using a remote control which can uh, control from uh, 500 meter or more than this is depend upon the location where you are using inside or outside and it is working with infrared and uh, it has the it has release so each uh, circuit you can put up and control the each motor traction and uh, it's very easy function this remote device i buy online if you didn't find the uh, link uh, please send me a message i will send you the link here you can see it is running with very high sound and uh, sometime when you stop it gets stuck and again uh, we have to rotate the motor and again it is starting with very high sound so this again the same problem the sensor cable connections are not proper
uh, now it is finalized it is uh, rotating uh, properly so i will solder the wires also after that i will insulate the wires to cover it to avoid uh, short circuiting uh, it is uh, better uh, uh, to solder uh, because if loose connection then uh, uh, you will lose the control of the motor if you learn something please subscribe my channel thank you green with blue is green from controller blue to the motor sensor okay then white from the controller and uh, green from the sensor and yellow with yellow both controller and motor sensor both yellow we will insulate this one or to avoid short circuiting Now I will show you how to make connection with the relays uh, for the start stop and the direction because uh, both uh, motor are running in required with the same direction. Now you can see both uh, motors are running same direction but normally when you put the, this controller uh, one motor will uh, run on reverse. So for that uh, what I did I put one jumper here so so is from ground to reverse so it's change the direction and these two wires these two wires I use as a switching this is stop switch but the problem is with this switching if there is any loose connection I, I will show you if any loose connection motor will run continuously so in this controller actually it is not in series if it is like series you can uh, remove cable and cable broken it should stop but in in this controller if it is connected then it is stopped if if not connected then stop so this is the uh, problem with this controller this controller is uh, zx x 11h version 1 so for that uh, another solution is there if you want to put switching put with the positive power supply but uh, again you need uh, uh, high amperes uh, high load switch otherwise uh, it will uh, burn uh, so that only solution for that switching i hope you like this video and uh, you know how to connect the controller and uh, change the direction and the motor uh, normal running and uh, if uh, it is not proper running making sound how to correct it uh, please like the video and subscribe my channel thank you very much once again please don't forget to subscribe thank you